to Katie Picks. What are you doing here? It's a Sunday. Guys, we're starting a brand new tradition. If you've been part of this community for a long time, then you will know that I upload recipes every Tuesday, vlogs fairly poorly shot, capturing my life on a Friday, and then new tradition has begun. As of today, people, every single Sunday, I will be uploading a classic YouTube video. Now, what do I mean by that? Basically one-on-one. -on -one. It's me and you chatting, it's screen to screen, face to face, uh, and also YouTube challenges, because I love them. I get really addicted and it's what I procrastinate most with, is watching ridiculous challenges on YouTube that just never really felt like they had a place in my vlogs or in my recipe videos. So I've been selfish and greedy and decided to have another day of filming and fun. If you have a particular challenge or a particular style of video that you want to see, please let me know in the comments box below. This is kind of like the fun day where I can do anything. For today's video, we are going to be shooting my March favourites, April favourites. I mean, I honestly don't know what category this falls in. I will do my research and then change the title accordingly. Because is it what I've used? To me, it's what I've used during March. I'm it out in April, April so it then seems month. to upload something. So yeah, should we kick off with, um, with my March favourites? April favourites. Some favourites. If you saw this vlog, then you will have seen that I paid a little trip to Leeds with my cousin. We ended up going into Anthropology, which is just quite frankly one of the most beautiful shops in all the land. Everything's like handmade and beautiful. And as a little token of our adventures, he bought me and my other cousin this candle. So we've all got the same candle that we all get to light and think about that amazing weekend we had in Leeds. I don't even know what the smell is. Mm. That, that's what it smells like, but I love it. Am I breaking YouTube tradition by doing a comforter, but uh, a softener? This is Comforts Creations Honeysuckle and Sandalwood. If you are responsible for the washing in your house, buy this. <laughs> oh my God, I love you so much. You smell amazing. It smells insane. The smell is like the most rich, vivid thing known to mankind, it lasts forever. Like, I washed my bed sheets four days ago, I think it was. Getting into them last night, it was like getting into a freshly made bed. Beautiful, beautiful. Let's go on to books. This is a very obscure collection of favorites, by the way. Nothing is of the same category. The Night Circus. This has dominated my reading over the past couple of months. The reason it's taken me so long, because it's actually not a hard book to read, it's got lovely big writing, and it's not that big. I'm just terrible, and the only chance I get to read is on my commute. And I more often than not get distracted by a crossword or something. It is brilliant. It is so well written. I'll give you the blurb. I don't want to give anything away because it is such an, a fascinating read. The circus arrives without warning. No announcements precede it. It is simply there when yesterday it was not. That's all it says. Do you know what? That's, that's just classic. That's classic of this book. It doesn't need to give you anything more. It's magical, mysterious, exciting, unexpected, beautiful. And uh, if you're looking for a read, I highly, highly recommend this. Rimmel, Wake Me Up, Anti-Fatigue, Foundation. Mine is in ivory for a high street drugstore bog standard foundation. It is brilliant. The colour match is amazing. It covers well, it brightens, it's a beautiful consistency. It's just a really lovely, like, makeup staple. Mask of Magna Minty. Really, very nearly running out. Oh dear, really running out. This is from Lush. It is a mint face mask made of all good things and I had really bad dry skin and outbreaks around my mouth last month, which drove me up the wall. And this got rid of it all. It just, for me, it really, really worked. It solved it. It was beautiful, left my skin feeling fresh and bright and zinging and I loved it. My Adidas Gazelles looking very, very dirty because they are so well loved. I love them, they go with everything. They're comfortable, they're snazzy, they make me look, look stylish and 
feel like I'm cool and feel like I deserve to be a YouTuber and live in London and go and hang out in, in Shoreditch. They just are great and comfy and they look good and they need a wash. Tom Ford. Oh, you're so schnazzy. You're showing off a little bit, NK. Not meaning to. Velvet Orchid, my favorite scent of all time. I actually bought this for my fella, Simon. Bless him. It's a unisex scent, but it just suits me better. So I got given this and denim jackets. I bought this, oh my goodness. It must have been first year of uni first year of university the reason that this is in my my favorites is because when this jacket comes out I know that the sun is finally here in the UK and oh I have missed you sunshine I hope you enjoyed this I know it's a bit silly and a bit random but I really really like videos like that like this it just it appeals to my tastes for those it also appeals to yeah, hopefully you've just enjoyed a few minutes on a Sunday of relaxation and respite. And for that, I will never apologize. If, however, you do not like this sort of content, I am so sorry, but do not worry because there will always be a recipe on a Tuesday. There will always be vlogs on a Friday. So just pick your favorite type of content and just ignore that the others exist. Yeah? Subscribe, follow me on Instagram, follow me on Facebook, Twitter, at the Katie Picks, and I will see you on Tuesday for a delicious recipe. Oh, timing. Bye guys. Where's my phone?